<laughs> oh, right, everyone, Shika and Hogan here reporting for the battle. So, welcome to Zexa, which apparently you are gonna be UC. It's been such a long time since last time you came here. <laughs> oh, that it's been really a while by now because last time you visit me was when back when well, I'm playing Gundam Breaker as well, which is on February. Wow. Okay, that's quite a while ago by this point. I mean... <laughs> Hang on, I, I put on my mask. I forgot to put off my mask real quick. Hello! <laughs> so, yeah. I think we all know why we are here today, aren't we? <laughs> I'm pretty sure we both know why are, why are we here today. <laughs> uh, let me... You know what? Just real quick, I'm going to show what's exactly causing this whole situation here. I wasn't expecting that I'm going to play this game again after months of finishing it, okay? I, uh, uh, hang on, by the way, Zexal, how are you doing today? <laughs> uh, but yeah, I am pretty sure I wasn't expecting myself as well to play the game that I don't want to play. After I'm done, basically, because basically after I'm done, it's done. There is not much that I can do. But here we are, and that was because of this right here. Yes, I do remember you. You see, I mean, back in February, you, it's been such a long time. You, you're the one who talk about. Okay, at least I don't see what, who I'm simping for. Uh, <laughs> yeah, you're the one who talk about building a gunpla back then, right? Remember Tower Persona? Nah, I prefer the double Aquanta command. And anyway, the reason why I'm starting to play the, the game again, in fact, I just downloaded it today, is because of this right here. This news. The Gundam, Break, the Gundam Breaker Bat Batlog project combining games, gunpla, and anime is starting in summer 2021. And oh boy, I am really hype about this. Like, holy shit. I mean, yes, it was announced on June 15th. Well, it's, U it's US time on this. It's June 16th on Southeast Asia at the time. Um, that the Gundam Breaker Redlock project, a project that will unfold over games, gunpla, and anime, will start in summer 2021. Which I cannot wait to see how it's performed because... Oh boy. Obviously, they try to tie in the game series to an anime and basically try to sell more gunpla <laughs> i mean that's the whole intention of it right but yeah that's what they are and well i'm looking forward because it's an a six episode ova and i'm really looking forward to it and i'm really hyped about it okay and yes i know it's gonna i mean well don't mind about the forza horizon i, I haven't changed it because that's not what we're going to use for playing but yeah Hello, man. Uh, welcome to the stream. How, uh, by the way, how's everyone doing? I hope you guys are doing fine. Especially you, Zexal. I mean, I haven't seen you for a long time by now. <laughs> um, anyway. <laughs> so yeah, a bunch of new gunplay is released. And, well, while the game is... There is no actual plan about the game when I read this here. A certain new site is... Click baiting people, oh yeah, there is gonna be a, a plan for a game, which, well, in a way, it kind of makes sense why they try to make a battle log series of a certain franchise of theirs, or series, but yeah, bunch of new gun plus here, like Helios, uh, Lifeland, Lifelands, uh, it's really hard to pronounce, Lifelands Heaven, uh, Perfect Strike Freedom, uh, what else? Blazing. Blazing is pretty cool, by the way. Um, Barbara Taurus is pretty alright. And my favorite is the Double O Command Quanta. This is... Oh my god, this is so sexy. Also, the recolor version of a bunch of units, like the Ground-type Gundam and the Gulf Custom, both got a recolor, which is kind of surprising, actually, because both of them, I actually like it. It's just that I haven't got a, I haven't bought a golf in my collection. <laughs> it's dumb. 
I should buy it. I I have like ground type and easy egg on my shelves, and I don't have a go custom on it. <laughs> but yeah, and there is a my bad frame inversion and the 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 Gundam Sky Zero, which is well, these four are just three color, but the three color on the ground over combat type is pretty nice. The reason is obviously because it's red. Like when are we going to see a red golf, right? Three band four, the three color. Yes, I know. That's unfortunate to be honest. <laughs> it's so tempting to just repaint my ground type Gundam here <laughs> to just use this, but oh my god, this looks so good. I I'm going to buy it, I'm pretty sure. I mean, it's just 200 yen difference between the common quanta and the <laughs> ground type, but yeah. But yeah, the most interesting part about this short movie, well, it's the sixth episode OVA, is the fact that when they talk about this, it says the characters from the smartphone game app Gundam Battle Gantla Warfare, which is the mobile game that's Japanese, and on Japan it's called. Gundam Breaker Mobile, by the way, and the characters from PS4 and Vita game Gundam Breaker 3 will appear in the anime. And you know what? There is no mention about New Gundam Breaker. They just throw New Gundam Breaker into the dark past. Like, holy shit. <laughs> that is the reason why I play this, because just to remind people, yeah, this thing exists. <laughs> oh, man. But yeah. You know, let's start the game real quick uh i'm i'm really looking forward to this project because finally gundam breaker has an anime basically in a way even though technically gundam build fighter and build diver is practically anime version of gundam breaker but at the same time it's not because there is no relation to it right like oh my god i'm so excited for the Battlelog project this time. I mean, the Build Fighter Battlelog is also pretty nice. Build Diver is meh, unfortunately. Like, as much as I want to like it, it's just, oh yeah, let's battle up with a gun plot that's just a strike build. Yeah, that's gonna be exciting. Like, somehow, the entire Build Diver series is miss a mark on both the main series, well, at least the first season. The second season is a bit on point, but still missing it. And then the battle log version of the build diver is completely missing the fact that we are talking about a custom gunpla battle, you know? But no, let's just make a let's just use a strike build gunpla. <laughs> uh oh well. That's just how it is, right? I mean Build Diver is basically the new Gundam Breaker, in my opinion. The new Gundam Breaker of the, their anime series. At least one of them. Because there is, I believe, another one that also has suffered the same fate with <laughs> these two, right? Um, anyway. Insert Shikai... Insert Shut Up and Take My Money. Yes. Like, by this point, I don't give if it's a P money or not. I just want it. <laughs> Sad, too bad, and she was given no time to evolve because it's just a little too far off the mark, like way too far off actually. Like they try to make a PvP game out of it, make the entire campaign a select screen base. I mean, look, you remember this, right? This is the campaign. This is how you progress through, and there is no risk of taking the wrong choice because everything is basically the right choice. It's just a different characters. That's about it. And I still can't believe I haven't do the. I haven't extract this. Whatever. <laughs> it's been too old. I don't. I don't want to do it again. Unfortunately. New Gundam Breaker characters are not gonna be in the backlog, as they mentioned on the article. So, yeah, even though there is only three games that actually... Well, actually four. and Yeah, actually four, I think. 
four games that actually use the Gunpla Arena that's like gonna build fight, right? Obviously the first well, okay, maybe not, maybe three, because the first one you only show that you're in the lobby. I don't even remember what's the story about on the first Gundam Breaker. On Gundam Breaker 2, you uh, your character is using the arcade capsule simulator, which is well, it's actually pretty cool when you look at the real life version, but I only saw it in video unfortunately. Which somehow the story is about you is not actually a human or something. Like you're not there for some reason. Which is kinda like the Gundam Build Diver story. In a way. The, at least the revise. And then the third Gundam Breaker is actually a gun. Most of the time it's just you fighting in the tournament to make your shop known more to the wider audience, which is a pretty more realistic stuff, right? But yeah, and then here we are just and then this game suddenly yeah, let's just make a dating sim out of a Gundam games. That's gonna work. Like, this is completely missed the mark about Gundam Breaker somehow. I wonder what the executive thinking when they are giving this idea to the developer. Developer just doing the, their job. <laughs> and they do it by the request of the, the higher ups, right? So, yeah, let's make a dating sim out of a Gundam Breaker. Like, what? I'm pretty sure some of the dev team just go, what? What are they thinking? <laughs> so, this exists. Not to mention, oh yeah, let's make it a multiplayer only game. But with campaign that used the game mode from the multiplayer as well. That's going to work, which unfortunately it doesn't. Well, it's fortunately it doesn't work for us players, but it doesn't work for the company, that's for sure. <laughs> it's just disaster with New Gundam Breaker and there is the Gundam Breaker Mobile which also used the same style arena like Gundam Build Fighters but well it's the same concept with this except it's not a dating sim most of the time some sometimes it does it does become a visual no novel dating sim a little bit but not by much Mostly just for the event, but still, it's there. Um, yeah. Anyway. Just to refresh your story. Yeah, last time we play is on February here, 27th. You can see them. That's the last time we play on 2021. Other than that, there is none. Look at that. Yeah, February is the last time we played. Um, Zexal was gonna be UC back then, so yeah. So now let's build a new unit. I mean, before we do that, actually, let's show off some of my old stuff, old school stuff. We have the Stinger, we have the Super Antares. Which is basically, uh, well, technically speaking, in terms of looks, it's the upgraded version of Antares, which somehow has less stats. Well, more brick power, but the rage power is degraded. Melee is somehow increased. It's weird. <laughs> but yeah, NGP equals dating sim. They've they've just hired someone from Illusions Incorporated. So, uh, the thing is. That's gonna be a little too much, that's one thing. <laughs> if you know, you know. But the other thing is, we're talking about not the entire game. We're talking about the story. Like, I mean, I'm fine with the story, but at the same time, it doesn't work, unfortunately, so. Eh? Eh, I show you. May I show you for the win? Oh my god. <laughs> is that I or AI? Hang on. Oh, it's I. Sorry, because the text is quite small. It's kind of hard to look from this far. Like, I mean, it's about 60, 70 
probably a meter actually. Oh, it's less than a meter. It's about 80 centimeter. But yeah, my eye is not good. What graphics card do you have? It's still the 1060. I don't even have a, an upgraded one. Obviously, because it still works, so... You know. Yeah, it's 1060 Ti, if I remember correctly. Either, either 1060 or 1060 Ti, I, I kind of forgot. But it works fine. Like, I mean, I know it's still on medium, yes, but... It, it looks nice already, so I don't really care. I mean, I've used to a lot of games on low graphics, and honestly, as long as it still looks pleasing in the eyes like this, you know, it's fine. I mean, then again, my PC is pretty medium and during 2019, so yeah. Anyway, well, let's go look around here. There is the threat driver. And speaking of Red Driver, apparently there is a Red Driver in the Universal Sentry. I don't know where it came from. Um, some of the players from Gundam Battle Operation probably know what I'm talking about, but... <laughs> no one expect a Red Rider. I was expecting, oh, but they only have Pell Rider, so there is no way they make a blue a red version. I'm like, well, what else they make one? Oh, nice! You can get the thirty sixty. That's nice. Good for you if you can get it, because I cannot afford that. It's it's just way too expensive for me. But then again, yeah, if you have the money, feel free. In fact, it's it will be really good for you. So have fun with that. <laughs> Red Pell Rider was from Ferrari. No. <laughs> Don't say that name here. I don't want to get sh sued all set of uh, racing their car. <laughs> okay, I was just kidding, but <laughs> yeah, it's it's basically Pell Rider in red color with different traits. I only watch people play Gun Battle Operation because I don't have the console, but I was just baffled. Like, what? They have the red version of this thing? <laughs> It's dumb. Like, I wasn't expecting that. <laughs> Flail through doesn't expect that. Um, who else? Seraphic Zero. Seraphic Zero or Zero Seraphic? I kind of forgot his name. But he doesn't expect that as well. Like, most of the YouTubers that play Gundam Battle Operation didn't know that Red Rider exists. Let alone the one that doesn't even play. <laughs> oh man, it, it's full of surprise. Gonna be the operation, really. Yeah, fifteen hundred dollars. That's my entire PC. God damn it. <laughs> my my entire PC is around fifteen hundred dollars. Even even less actually because of the currency. But yeah, but I plan to buy it on Black Friday. Well, I wish you good luck if you want to buy that because oh boy, people will. Be trying to get that lot. Oh my god, it's been a while. The gear friend, the gear girlfriend. <laughs> oh man. Oh, this is hilarious. I really love it. <laughs> the splitter. The Mugen Konik Kaiser. Oh my god, it's it's quite nostalgic when seeing a bunch of stuff like this, you know? Frostbear, oh boy. You can. The meme stupid shit that's full of sexual innuendos here. It's stupid. <laughs> the kid Taba Golden Ballsy. Uh, this thing is dumb. <laughs> oh my god. This quite takes a memory because I made this for a certain someone. If you know, you know. I'm not going to mention it to, to Nike. <laughs> the Dream Guard, yeah, is really nice. The Katyusha, which is just a tank. This Silver Tail is also pretty cool. Like, this is really beastly, but... I have to sacrifice melee weapon, and if I pick up a melee weapon during combat, I'll I'm stuck with that melee weapon. <laughs> 
Miss Eugen, the Queen Jacket. I do you like this? This cursed thing. <laughs> oh, shut up, Rat. <laughs> don't, don't say it. <laughs> uh, it's okay, though. Wait, what? Hang on. I never installed a frame abilities on this thing. <laughs> what? I can't believe that. But yeah, Rat, you know. So you know. Okay? If you, if you don't know, that's fine, but if you know, you know. Let me sanitize. I submit this to Red Wolf Fion on his celebration or anniversary. I kind of forgot. It's placed up on the front of the video like, holy shit. <laughs> uh, man. That's really something. Alright? Like, this is. My clip was the only clip. That is featuring this game. Other than this, other than that, it's just full of Gundam Metal operations everywhere. I mean, well, to be fair, no one's really playing New Gundam Breaker anymore at that at, at this point. So, yeah. <laughs> uh, I mean, well, some still, but most doesn't. <laughs> oh, the CAU Glock Reader, my original unit from. Uh, gonna break mobile. Well, not really my original because I'm using their parts, but oh well. It's actually changed recently to the backpack is changed to. Um, what is it? Ah, uh, what is it? What do I forgot now? The backpack is changed to Sasabi backpack, which is which works wonder by the way compared to this the, on. On this game, by the way, because it's a finisher. But yeah, the Swap Shredder, which is the Black Knight. My version of Artemis. I named this Artemis com and completely forgot that Gundam Breaker Mobile has Artemis as well, except it's different. So, yeah, the Ultimatum, which is just a bunch of unicorn parts. This is RGB unicorn, by the way, if I remember correctly. No, it's not. It's not. The other one is one. This one back when <laughs> Hachama was eating a spider. No, a tarantula, sorry. Not spider, tarantula. It's dub. <laughs> Alongside with the Zeong Chamai. We built we built both of them in a single stream. It's it's really dumb. Maybe war crime during December. While waiting for a new year. Actually it's not. Because it says 26th of December. Long set with the swaggy booby. Yeah, bruh. It's, it's swag, bruh. Oh my god, it's it's terrible. <laughs> but my sense of humor is terrible. I'm, I'm sorry. That is the sheriff, which is a space pirate that is not as crossbow, by the way. New Gundam, I, it's just a placeholder to be honest, but oh well. Alongside Akatsuki, and I don't want to remember this. This stupid thing. Alongside this other stupid thing back when... Like, this is before the new year. This is after the new year. <laughs> uh, what am I making there? The Sharpedo, I don't really use that. Yeah, the Unicorn 7 is the RGB Unicorn that I make. <laughs> the Alta Blazer. And well, this is the basic part here. So anyway, let's start creating. Because... Why not, right? Let's first thing first. Let's... Make sure everything is back to the most default setup here. Which is just Gundam parts. Makes things easier to work on. Um, hang on, how, how do I remove this? X. X skill is just basic and the frame is balanced. Alright. So. 
This is our blank slate here. Let's just call it blank for now. Because this is the base version, so what do you want me to build? I want to ask you, what do you want me to build? Well, we are talking about the backlog, like some theories and stuff that come up to my head recently. Cause, well, when they announced the battle log, the first thing I noticed is Misa from Gundam Breaker 3 on their banner. Like, wait, Misa? Like, what? Hang on, I got a message from Xbox. That's very rare. Um, anyway. Right, no, that's not shift tab. That's Windows G. Uh, so, you know. I was expecting. Holy shit! They're trying to. To, you know. To give attention to the Gundam Breaker again? To the greatest Gundam Breaker game, in fact? Because that's. Gundam Breaker 3, if you don't know, is the peak performance of the entire series like holy shit that thing is so good like you can practically do everything right so you know you just have to what is it Yes, you got to be speculating that they're trying to make a new mainline Gundam Breaker at that point, right? Like, they they try to give some care to, you know, this game, the series again, give some life again. Even though, to be fair, the Gundam Breaker Mobile, or Gundam, are known internationally as Gundam Breaker, uh, Gundam Battle Gunpla Warfare, is still alive and I would say quite well I guess uh, that's quite a stretch to be honest because they lack mat mat um, innovation in that so you know it's means I guess they trying to milk more of the game in a way Maybe not, maybe not milking. That's the wrong word, I mean. Uh, maybe they do want to make a new Gundam Breaker game, right? In fact, because of that, um, after I ran about this game a few months ago, probably already have half a year by this point, or, or more, I promise in that video that I'm going to make a follow-up where I'm going to make, give a suggestion if they ever plan to make a new Gundam Breaker game. Kinda of forgot about that up until they release the recent news about the Battlelog project. I have a hunch that they are making a new Gundam Breaker game. And, I, and if that's true, oh that's gonna be fun. I mean, well, unlike a certain news network where it says, oh yeah, the, 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 the entire headline is just, oh yeah, it's planning to make a game and stuff, so yeah. It's stuff like that. Are we going to get Forza Horizon 5? Hmm. That's a difficult question. Because, one, that's not the current topic. And two... Uh, how do I say it? Like, I have so many consideration after last time, but I mean, maybe? Who knows? We'll see. But that's for my for my future me to worry. My current me still hype for Gundam games. Uh, <laughs> so, you know. Oh, where was I? Um, so with the with that, 
I did make a script around 1500 uh, words about how to increase, <laughs> how to improve on the Gundam Breaker game with the base build from Gundam Breaker 3 at least because this game is hopeless. The new Gundam Breaker is hopeless. The Gundam Breaker Mobile is stagnant. Just adding more units as far as I can tell. But gameplay wise, it's just there. Like, even if they added the crew, which I just checked recently because of this news as well. Uh, they just kinda add a lot of new units. They have a guild, basically a guild style. Um, community in the game as well now, but gameplay-wise, there is not there, there there is nothing more. Like, I mean, well, they only increase stats. They have alteration part, yes, which you can turn in. Which basically, you can turn your 144 great unit to one 100 units. It's nice, but. That's it really. Like I don't see anything new with the Gundam Breaker Mobile. Which is kinda unfortunate to be honest. So yeah. It's really unfortunate when the only living games right now is not the most desirable game to play. Not to mention it's a gacha game, so it's really messy. I mean technically drops on this game is also gacha but you know, it's nice at least. Because you don't have to pay more after you buy it for the first time. At least from what I see because there's not even a single DLC as far as I can tell. For this game, unlike the previous game which is gonna break up 3, it has 6 DLC alright. Like holy shit, that's a lot. At least for me that's a lot because more than that I don't even care at, at that point but yeah, whatever. Anyway, we are building something here that I I don't know what to build, to be honest. I mean, you can tell me whatever you want to build. In this case... Just feel free to tell. If not, I'm just going to pick whatever part I want. But yeah. So, I, I did make a script of that okay it, it's probably a bit much for some but you know it's just that i want the game to be good i want the i want the, the next game to be as good as the three and it's available on pc or at least they ported it to port the gundam breaker 3 to pc but yeah it's it's hard <laughs> Like, you know, one can only dream. And this is the closest thing that I can get because I don't have console. I, I may buy PS4 sometimes in the future. Who knows? And then buy Gundam Breaker 3 and maybe a capture card. And then stream the game here. That should be fun, right? But, well, then again. That's my future me that can worry about that. My current me, the current me basically. I'll just have it the fun right now. Speaking of Pell Rider, we can paint it to red and call it a uh, Red Rider. <laughs> like it's literally just Pell Rider in red. With that Red Rider from the Double Operation 2. So yeah. Let's see what I'm going to make here. Um, like I don't even care about stats right now. I just want to build something aesthetically nice. But I don't know what to build. You know what? 
Let us let's try use the palace Athena here. This thing is usually pretty hard to get something out of, but it might work. I said Mike, but I don't know. Until I start putting on some parts here and there. This thing is pretty slim. Mm. Let's try making it uh, to a high mobility unit with ball, I guess. <laughs> it's connected directly to the thrust. <laughs> oh, this felt like a riser. Like some random pipes just connected directly to the exhaust instead of the thrust, the proper thruster port. Like, what the hell? I mean, this can work, right? Right, guys? Oh, I can't believe my friend is starting streaming on Twitch. Holy shit. Maybe not. I don't think that will work, but oh well. The main problem with the Palace Athene is that it has a front pipe like that and it's kind of hard to connect it to something. Because the pipe came from the body instead of the leg. That's kind of hard to do because every time it moves it doesn't look right. Trust me. Let's try to make it slim enough. Find a slim leg here somewhere. Like most of the UC legs are pretty thick. But you know. Maybe there is some slim one. Maybe. I mean, even the Gundam like is still pretty thick on this, you know. Mm. Yeah, I have no plan here. This entire situation is unplanned, and I don't even have a plan for this as well. I'm not going to use the green tank Makaku again. Oh my god, what the hell? <laughs> Uh, mobile worker. Mobile worker is nice, but well, as you can see, um, it's not exactly what I want. I mean, the Zudalek is alright here. It has a hit hog as its EX, which, by the way, on Gundam Breaker Three, this is gonna be just. An optional part that you can use freely, by the way, without having to activate a certain skill, technically. But unfortunately, the way this game works is they try to make a MOBA, make a objective based PvP, as PvE PV, PvP, but it doesn't work. This bizarre looks is actually kind of working with Atlas here. Not with the ground type. <laughs> try mixing different era. Yeah, I'm going to try to mix it. I mean, well, most of the stuff here is still from <laughs> Universal Century. Oh god. <laughs> I mean, the cover kind of works to be honest because how slim the crutch is, but well. Alright, let's. You know what? The body is from Universal Sentry, right? Mm -hmm. But we're going to look one by one by one. Maybe we can get something really nice from the same era, but. We'll see. We'll see. I mean, like Zeta here is actually pretty fitting because, well, I think when it's not that far from Zeta. Ubili, Barzam, Advanced Hazel. You go for it, just watch Kakabat's video about Hazel. Hazel to be more precise. Ryro, Double Zeta. 
Gym 3 like is actually one of my favorite because it has uh skirt mounted rockets that's logical. In fact that's my main part on what is it? Uh, my Antares, so yeah. Oh wow. Superior Superior Gundam actually works fine here. Extraordinarily superior is not that much. Anyone want one v one me? One v one on what? The question is one v one on what game? Because this game cannot do one v one. Annoyingly enough. Oh, more pipes with the fast. <laughs> uh, let's not use that though. Hand grenade from Jagan. Uh, Gerardoga, Gunei, Yakdoga, Same Sazabi, Hainu, Unicorn, FA Unicorn, Banshee, Anju, Chatria, what am I supposed to do? Super Roboto! Hey Matthew! Welcome to the stream! How are you today? We are trying to make something out of Felis Athen body here. Which is gonna be really hard to use to be honest. Because Felis is pretty slim on the torso, but still like it's pretty thick on Felis Athen, which is really weird. But yeah. Rainbow is actually pretty alright. It has machine cannon and flexible beam gun. Whatever that means. F91, the Nanzo, Victory. Yeah, this part here is starting to get slimmer. A little bit. Maybe not the assault buster, but. <laughs> yeah. By the way, Matthew, have you seen the news? Oh god. <laughs> oh we Um Sarah Custom Have you seen the the news about the backlog? That one is awesome. What do you mean it has a beam sword? This is just a beam sword, not a whip. Hello Damgum, welcome to the stream. You can go now because <laughs> you, you usually don't care about this stream. <laughs> it won't show in chat. Oh, you have to chat something? Because it doesn't show at all. Alt Feng Yo, what? Some ugly user interface. Well, <laughs> I cannot deny that at all. <laughs> I cannot deny that. Then again, this game is very flawed. But then again, this menu is come from the previous game as well, so yeah. <laughs> and buffering. Uh, this is just you. <laughs> Not me, just you. But yeah. I'm just trying to search for something here. That can work with that st stupid piping from Palace here. That won't work. Oh my god. It connected to the crotch perfectly. <laughs> oh, why is it so perfect? Oh, come on now. This thing is so perfect somehow. A couple works as well, but the sumo somehow felt right with the piping from the body. Like, what? Oh, this is so weird. <laughs> 
Okay, none of the units from Sid would work here. Maybe do well, but that's it. Providence, that's that's a thing. One. Uh, Star Gazer is alright. Like legend, legend, legend is just a copy of Providence, so not much of that. Just have a bunch of generic lag. It won't work. Well, maybe the Akatsu, the Amatsu, but that's it. I mean, we can make it work with this actually. Yamatsu Mina. What's up, Sugi? Blue frame secondary fives. Yeah, I mean, Astro is actually working quite well because how small the skirt is. But other than that, it's not that great. You know what? Let's give it the Yamatsu Mina for now. Alright, so from UC to. Um, what is it? <laughs> Why am I forgetting? To... The alternate timeline to... Well, see it, basically. We need to make a small arm, though. That can hold... The sword there. Well, that's small, but not the kind of small that I want. <laughs> like, only the pincer is small. Other than that, it's pretty huge. So, anyway. After this, I may gonna binge watching the Build Fighters again. Because, I kinda miss that series, you know? And the only reason why I'm here, by playing this game again, it's simply because the fact that they announced a new series. As I mentioned multiple times, in fact, I already prepared a... What is it? A script. And gonna record it maybe tomorrow. Who knows? And try to publish it right on the third anniversary of this game, which is 22nd June this year so yeah on that day next week this game will be three years old by now like holy shit it's really old and everyone tried to forget about it but i can't because i buy it last year <laughs> uh steam discount man it do wonders you will buy something that you don't even think to buy be when there is a discount. Like, holy shit. <laughs> we can make a gorilla build, actually. <laughs> you know what? Let's make a gorilla build. Why not? Uh, but the body is way too small. I don't know. Let me make a gorilla build. Or something else entirely, I don't know. Oh, Zuda actually looks perfect. It has a shield. Has... Accelerator field. Oh yeah, this, this is actually perfect in terms of shape. Let's use that actually. Yeah, why not? I was planning to make a silly build, but looks like I'm, I, I don't think I will. I like backpack. Let's start from the bottom with the 144 version, please. Yakushiki Yeager is from 3 by the way. They, it never got a model kit. Which is kinda surprising. 
Also, the brick dies. This can kind of work. You know, I want to try to use this. Oh, I think I got the fission now. Nice. The moment you get the fission is the moment that you will start building something nice. Useful. It's just too big. This should give a shield. Oh, it's that. Okay, let's go with 144. It's too big. Uh, shield, shield, double shield, field shield. Field shield is ni nice, by the way, because you can ram into your enemy and basically flinging them, and you can just start hitting them again as well. And also it looks pretty, looks pretty small, so no one can notice most of the time. How about the jet shield? The jet shield is a little too big. Combination shield, anti-beam shield, 71. I wonder. Let's see. After this, I'm going to let you guys decide what I'm going to build. Okay? It'll be fun when that happens. Build turn A. By the way, where did Sapakol came from? I'm going to buy something real quick. Because I want that some arms. It it fits very well. In a way. Uh what is Astava, there we go. Oh wow, this is really light. Holy shit, 100 k That's quite expensive, but oh well. Anything from the looks, right? <laughs> as long as I don't have to grind again. It works alright, actually. I'm kind of surprised. Uh, Zuda arm is actually a little bigger than Astra series, you know? Considering how it looks. I mean look, we can switch to this arm and it looks rather smaller. Well not much smaller, but it felt big for some reason. Alright, let's pick up a hat. There is no other options here for the hat, don't doesn't it? Well, there is, because I don't have the proper one. Like, I want the Shinmusha here. But, well, maybe not. It doesn't fit right. I forgot how big, uh... Well, in body. Why are we still here? I don't know. Suffering? Who knows, right? Oh, this is the closest thing to a samurai, but yeah. Let's go with that. What happened? Where's the Tanegashima? I'm pretty sure I have the Tanegashima somewhere here. 
of Shabu Maru. No, Shabu Maru is from Mark Two. Just weirdly, it doesn't even look like a proper gun from that. Idol Bazooka. I think it's on the rifle section somewhere here. Because I remember I do have the Tangashima somewhere. Never really use it because it sucks. <laughs> uh maybe not. Yeah, probably not. I thought I had it though. Or was it just an illusion somewhere? Because I'm pretty sure I had the Tanegashima rifle somewhere. Hmm. Long rifle. It's just a beam rifle though. Yakurai? No, not Yakurai. Yakurai is from. What is it? Katsuki. It's supposed to be rifle. No, not that. Yeah, apparently I don't have it. I thought I have it though. What? Hang on, hang on, hang on, hang on. Where is she, Musha? Maybe not Shin Musha. Yeah, it's not Shin Musha, it's not Mark II at least. Yeah, I have the Tanegashima. It counts as missile launch, what? Yeah, I do have the Tanegashima. Okay, now it fixed itself, never mind. Okay, I don't know what you're talking about. Did something broken? Ah, uh, there it is. Somehow I cannot find it. Yeah, I don't understand how did, how I don't find it at all. Oh. Uh, swap the weapon. You know, let's pick up a Gabriela Strike instead. <laughs> Destiny, where's the F? Okay, let's pick up the Gabriela Strike. Why not? Okay, so melee. Well, balance frame or strike or frame? Ah, uh, you know, let's go with striker. Melee break power up, melee weapon damage up, damage, and break. Yeah, this is really limiting to go as well. Yeah, build parts. Nah, I don't feel like it right now. Like, it's already have plenty of stuff going on. By the way, I forgot what's the X skill on the hat. <laughs> Antenna, okay, that's not much useful, but oh well. Kanasurugi. Shin Sunrai Nichiren Slash. 
Then Koma pa sang Koma ko. Antana Kashima. What's going? Well, as you can see, it looks pretty nice. As far as I can tell. All right, let's start painting. Emblem off. All part. This boy is long, Barbie head though. Yeah, I mean, it's fairly slim, but it's much more meaty on the middle, unlike Barbados. So, yeah. Uh, first thing first, to make things easier, I usually do this. Make everything in primer color, so you can see what exactly changes easily. This helps a lot. Because you know what you're building basically. Well, at least most of the time. Let's make more chipping. Make it more pronounced. Oh, like it's battle ready, you know? Like just this white color with a lot of chipping and damage is actually very good already. Look, <laughs> this is just white color and it's already working well. Like, see what I mean? The sword, the gun looks really remarkable without having to paint it already. Prime it, baby. Yeah, gun number three, but he certainly has a torso. I know, right? <laughs> Now, the thing is, how are we going to color this? First thing first, let's make the pipe. Looks like a pipe color. That. Um. What to do here? Like I have so many color options at this point, but what are we color this? Do you have any suggestion about the color? Go green on the hose, so it looks like garden hose. <laughs> oh, why? Why you have to say that? <laughs> Oh my god, why do you have to say that? I want to make this aesthetically pleasing at least. Somehow. Is that golden? Make that golden for now. Ah, uh, body. I don't want too much colors. So. Let's play around some green here. Play a little bit with the greens here and there. Where this goes. A white green sim wouldn't hurt, I guess, but we'll see. This is just grey, practically speaking. I want to keep the yellow though. Because we need that. I feel like I need that. I think 
to what to do. Final setting has a really weird part to be honest from here and there. That's the time, you know? Yeah, that kind of work, I guess. Um, no, actually, no. Let's switch to green. I cannot make this a single piece color, that's a problem. Hello, Edge! What do I need is dark blue. Come on, guys, try to be unified about the opinion here and there. I don't know what to do. Go to the brown! Oh my god, no more color. Yes, I was gonna ask what is up with the chest cups. It's Palisatine! That's the problem! <laughs> Palisatine is really hard to work with to make a good model, to be honest. I'm not going to lie. I don't know what to do here. Like, I mean, dark blue doesn't work at this point, unless I change the entire color to blue. Uh, welcome, Edge. It's been a while. I saw your channel is alive, by the way. <laughs> Should I promote that? <laughs> uh, it's a running joke here, to be honest. <laughs> Dark blue. This is regular Gundam color then. Guess I can make it darker, I guess. Let's make it darker. Oh, that that midnight midnight blue right there. Alright, let's save that color here. Somewhere. That's also I mean I have to change some other stuff here. I mean yes, the blue can work, actually. Panas and Swaldo, oh shut up. <laughs> This color is really conflicting to us. Yeah, I'm going to make the pipe back to dark gray. This is... I'm just going with black color, I guess. I'm not sure. It's so weird. Like, it's a bra. It's practically a bra, isn't it? Ah, uh, no. Like, it's a suction cup. Like, what? Uh, this thing is really hard to work with, I'm not going to lie. A bro with yeah, I know, right? <laughs> I know, right? Should we just make this a Gundam color instead? That might work easier, you know. Yeah, actually, let's make it just a Gundam color for once. I never make a Gundam color style Gunpla before, so. I you know just this time. After this we can, we can after this build we, we're going to make some crazy build with you guys with your suggestion. How much little 
Really? That's a bit too much. Let's keep that white then. Yeah, let's try to make this into... Ah, it doesn't work because it's a single piece. Oh, what? I was thinking to make it, you know, into the typical Gundam Shield color, but it doesn't work. I mean... I can make it work, but... I don't think it will be that much. Okay, let's go with that color. Yeah, we end up making a Gundam color style for once. It's actually kind of weird because I never done this. <laughs> like in my entire time, I never make a Gundam color style unit actually. But Palisatin got me acting strange. Oh, shut up, Matthew! Don't be horny towards the Palisatin body! Uh, <laughs> why are you going to horny over a uh, Palisatin body? Like, holy shit. Get a hold of yourself. <laughs> ah, that can't stay wild, actually. This one, however. What the hell is this? What kind of launcher this is? I mean, then again, that's actually close to the Panzer Faust on this on the Gundam serial color. But yeah, would be fun if they decide to try to implement one of my build to their new Gundam games if they ever make one. I, I'm I'm wondering how it will end up though. They ever try to make one? Like oh yeah, they con like for for some reason they decided to contact me and try to negotiate on to making my unit into their game. I would be really happy if that ever happened though. I mean, it's an achievement that's for sure. Uh, yeah, Matsumina lag. It's up to right here. Alright, th that's up to sword piece. It's entire piece. Kinda makes sense in a way, but. Oh, my. oh. I want to make it metallic, but it's making the entire thing metallic. Oh well. Oh, some frame drop there. Weird. Uh no. Most of the parts are okay. Actually, it's not that bad. I mean, the entire frame is still red, but it's more on the section of it here and there so uh, I guess it kind of work I can't believe they make that into a single piece actually never mind I can just make this like that yeah that work actually much better did it put some metallic color on this thing well, somewhat. That will kind of stay around. Oh my god. <laughs> this is something, I must say. The hills are a bit extreme, yes. I mean, then again, this is gold. 
um, Astral Gold Frame Amatsumina version. Which is why it has that extraordinary style on the heel. You know? As for the backpack. Oh, it included the Nagashima color. Oh well, fine though. Let's make that that dark, I guess. color it but I want to call wood color it but it's kind of weird because we're using a Gundam color so keeping it a, a wooden color is kind of weird to be honest in my opinion at the same time it doesn't work with a uh, gray color here just to play like one of those separate pieces that you buy. Dark gray better. Okay, hey, okay. it's all right. Let's try that for now. Oh, the small ornament can be a gold. Oh yes, that works. That works. Um, the blade piece, though. Make it metallic. Make it metallic, and this part right here. Let's turn it into red. And why not, Mike? That works actually. I know! Thank you! Like, we're trying to make it work here to make a Gundam color style. I've never done this before actually. But in my entire life, I never used a Gundam. a basic Gundam color. Alright, the shield. Frame colors. That. Like, I cannot make the arms like that, unfortunately, because it's the entire thing. Look, it's so annoying. And I wish at least the arm just yes, not that. Yeah. Okay, let's make it like this. And this is a Gundam color, so we have to respect the usual color choice of them. Actually, that works fine. Just two of them. Yeah, that works just fine. Oh, hang on. This needs to be... Yeah. I forgot to change that color somehow. Oh well. I'm sure everything is alright here. Uh, yeah, I try to double check the white coloring here because they have different glossiness. Alright, this is all fine. Alright, now for the hat. Start with the Fivin, of course. Make it gold. The chin is red.
glossy wait this uh, red color again I mean this is Barbados after all I don't think that should be white right I mean this is just basic Barbados at the end of the day as far as I saw the OG Gundam, yeah, it attracts kids, but by the times went by, it works for us. I don't know why, but mm, it just feels that color for a Gundam. I know, right? Like, this is the iconic color for a Gundam, basically. If a Gundam doesn't use this, that means it's not exactly the main character, isn't it? <laughs> I mean, even R3 is... I mean, even for Gundam has multiple ar multicolor armor, right? R3 is blue, Mars 4 is red. Even that has Gundam color, if even though it's separated by type, at least. But it works. Go color stays. That. I have to imitate the. Gun there. <laughs> that is that. We try to make it the same as the gun right there, you know, which is kind of difficult to do, to be honest. Because I don't exactly. It doesn't have exactly the same layer. I mean, it's close, but. This what it is. Dark. Oh, it is that dark. Actually, no, it's this one. What's your favorite Gundam, by the way? Mine's Double Zeta. I have a few favorite, of course. One of them, if you ever saw it on my scrolling tags, that will be the Zero XMS team. The other is Gundam Build Fighters, the first one, not the Build Fighters try. And uh, what else? Um, yeah, Zero Egg MS Team is actually my favorite. That's number one. There is no, de there is no denying on that one. But yeah. Ah, oh, the mobile suit. If you're talking about the mobile suit, my favorite is the Gundam Ground type and Easy Egg because they look so heavy. I love it. But then again, I have quite a lot of favorite on the series. But every time I talk about Gundam. Either the Gundam Ground type or the Easy Egg would be basically my go-to unit. If not them, it's it's gonna be Zuda. So yeah, like yeah, I mean, to a stretch, if I want something entirely different, like from Build Fighters series or what is it yeah build fighter or build diver it's something like um command fumina for example i do have her by the way 
and double O, well, well, the, the a double O based one, the Shia Quanta. That one is also pretty nice. But yeah, it's really something. We're making Gundam color here. It's more difficult than I expect, to be honest. I'm not going to lie. Right, let's start with the blade piece. I'm going to follow the silver color there. This pop should be yellow. Well, gold can work. Gold works too, actually. Pops of it to be dark blue that we use. At the end of the day, we're making a three color style here. What is this? Oh, that's the end piece there. I can't believe this somehow works, to be honest. Yeah, this somehow works really well. I can't believe my eyes here. Legs are too wide. I honestly agree, but the problem is this is gold frame. So this entire back part is a single frame and it's annoying to work with. Like I cannot deny it's way too wide. Yeah, that doesn't work. Like, the red is supposed to be a, an accent color, but if I try to paint this part, it's the entire front. I try the other part, that's the entire back. <laughs> it's all sorts of wrong, you know? Because this is basically just a red frame. But we're trying to make a Gundam color, so... You know. That's just how it is. Um, let's go with the Federation logo here. On the chest somewhere. Because there is no crotch piece that actually... That work. We got to do some complementary stuff, but ah, that should be good enough. That's it. That's enough. Not much sticker, not much anything, but it works. And that's what matters. Mm. Yeah. Black is a little too wide, but cannot make it work that's the problem like we we've using some of the most complex part here and there you know <laughs> that usually don't combine well but yeah, it works really nice here all right let's give it a name Uh, let's give it a name, I'm not sure though. Um, maybe BX. <laughs> this is really uncreative, but we're gonna give it a, give it any name. Diego. Ooh, interesting naming actually. Yeah, 
Diego Gundam. Let's give it RX R78 because this is RX replica basically. It's a it's a replica color. Like Mike as well. As for BGM. Okay, let me that off. I'm trying to find a nice one. Ken because it's Japanese and Ken is a male Barbie doll. We can go with that as well. Which one? Do you want me to name this Diego or Ken? Go with Assault Waves instead. I mean it's alright. No? Uh, you want me to use Ken or Diego? I mean, we can work with both. Can do. <laughs> I said can do, by the way. <laughs> of all things. For some reason, that came across my mind. Can Diego? Ah, uh, it's not enough, but oh well. It's a bit too much because I think more extension doesn't help. Like, I want to call it Kendo Diego. <laughs> How about that? <laughs> Kendo Diego. It's a, It has a nice rhyme on it. I'm not going to lie. What should we really? <laughs> oh, you agree? Uh, do you guys agree with this? <laughs> the Kendo Diego I'm X replica 78 Kendo Diego because <laughs> Because the body is somewhat western-ish style and then the entire thing is just Japanese weapon right? like why? <laughs> uh I know, Mike. Right? It's it rhymes very really nice. Kendo Diego. It's so weird, though. But it works, like. Right? All right, let's try this out. Let's try this out. See what I can do here. Let's go to to the submission. I'm going to bring Marika and Jinatsu. Two of the best girl that I like on this game. Because they have more personality in my opinion. In a way. Oh yes, look at that. Maybe I should have gone with the soundtrack from Bar from I remember the orphans instead of the what is it? From Stardust Memory here. Yeah, this is from Stardust Memory. I have to stop by the way every time I shoot. And the ammunition is not that much. Oh. 
返しです明日まとにならないよう頑張りますバカッ Oh my god, that guy is really annoying. Well, I got one. Got something. Self defense is active. Now, I can heal. This is ridiculous. Ow. I got stuck. This is pretty really cool, though. Oh, oh it still hits. Somehow. I only have a bunch of stuff here that buff instead of, you know, actually do something. You need to search Diego on Gundam community of Facebook. That's not... Oh, really? Is that an actual law or something? Holy shit, there's a shot via them. A very well known floor. Really? I actually don't know that. Alright, let's see if I have some part here. Oh, the booster is actually pretty long. Let's make up for some parts here. This game is still, is still janky as ever. Oh, okay. That hurts. That's buddy. That's what you get for kicking my face. No. Well, I'm doing well here. I'm trying to recover this part here. <laughs> but yeah. Random community of her Facebook. Oh yeah, I do have storm files by the way. I want to enforce. Yeah, there we go. Holy shit! I lost almost all of my part there. <laughs> That's ridiculous. Oh, 
Still hot, still alive. Well, kill the well, you have the chance. Oh, my body is broken. I don't have. I don't. I only have the body right now. My sword is gone. Oh god, I'm missing a bunch of stuff here. I still have one more shield though. What the hell? What? Oh, that's cool actually. Ah, uh, maybe spec all cool. He's on the north. Oh, that's not my call. Ah, there's too much of them. Oh, there she is. I lost my body, by the way. <laughs> that's my loss is actually the hardest boss in New Gundam Breaker. Really? That's that's not a, it's not that hard. Tomai is not hard. Come on. I got the peacock smasher. Nice. I don't think it's that hard. Tomai is not the hardest thing to fight. In my opinion, as this is not that hard. Not sure about you guys. That's why the game lacks of challenge. Ah, makes sense now. That makes sense now. That's make a lot of sense now. And I think about it. I have to talk like a lot of this. Oh, this boost is felt so slow. After I'm playing so much on Gundam, on Mass Builder, this felt really slow. <laughs> I got sub knuckle, okay. My hand is on the south. Here I am just farming containers. Like seriously, the problem about this supposedly PvP mode on this game is the fact that you can just mind your own business and win anyway. Well, I lost that one, but that's fine. For now. I mean, that's just one. I got the finisher, by the way. Holy shit. That's why this, uh, But I do love to build a Gundam. Here, since this game is on PC, yes, this is the only Gundam Breaker on PC, unfortunately. The other Gundam Breaker that is accessible to us is, you know, the mobile game, which is really hard to create a build of. Mm. 
I'm just leveling up here. Don't mind me. Oh, hello. I have a thing. Oh, I actually have to feel nice. Like at least I can move a little faster. Ah, it's stuck on the roof. Oh, it doesn't die, really? So many parts here. Let's go out. Uh, up, uh, up. Yeah, it, um, yeah, it's a bit unfortunate because this is the only random break of the game on PC. And I wish that it, there are more, but well, here we are. Holy shit, that's that's basically a home base. Yeah, this, this game is pretty easy. I'm not going to lie. Oh, hello. What's up on this game? Oh, let's go just here. Oh, it's stun. Oh, that skill is actually pretty cool. If only it works properly. Because it doesn't, to be honest. Oh, 
Well, like, everything is up. That's what kind of Suruki. I haven't tried that as well, but probably just a bit so crush. Oh, by the way, the entire time I play this game, I never get the hidden container. So, yeah, that is that as well. Yeah, it's just... Don't do that. Just stop that. Alright, they're going to kill Senna soon, I'm pretty sure. And this is the perfect build because self defense kills you. Oh, I don't have to worry too much about it. If I didn't have to kill Senna. Oh, you don't even found this as well. Or maybe once, but I probably forget about it. I mean, considering how uneventful to find a container in this entire game. Yeah. That's probably the case, isn't it? Oh, I never get this wing. Nice. We get the Wing Gundam Zero and the Swartz backpack here. Mega Beam Shield and Wing Gundam R. Okay, one more fight. And then we go to build another unit. How about that? And the next one is up to you guys. I am not going to interfere whatsoever. Maybe I will a little bit giving, give my opinion, but that's it really. But other than that, we are going to mess around with some rather wacky build. Hopefully. <laughs> I mean, it's up to you guys. If you guys want to make a wacky build or a really cool build, that's really up to you guys, but uh, you know. That's really up. I don't. I will just leave it up to you guys, okay? I trust you people to make a really good build. Hopefully. <laughs> I mean, this is already pretty good. Like for a melee unit, this is pretty alright. In a game where. Melee is discouraged so much. Oh god. Ah, no. Stop that. Too much of you is styling on me. I don't like that. Hey, look, what happened? I'm going to die. Oh, maybe not. I can't believe that hit. I can't believe that hit. <laughs> no! Ooh! I'm dead. <laughs> I died. Use 100. One to 100. My snipe lag. One ask for a wife who one wants a mag mag knife lag. Do I have that though? I wonder. I saw that level up, what the hell? Oh. I have some fun, I never see. Well, someone watching, might as well, you know. 
from some container to level up. It's kind of hard to find a container here, so I, let's just go out. I need offensive skill, please. Oh my god, this is pretty sure. <laughs> Okay, this attack is there. Oh, it's just spawned in like that. What the hell? Like, there is no effect of covering animation to it, you know? Oh, it's going to die. Boom! <laughs> oh, that hurts a lot. That hurts a lot, isn't it? Let's heal while we're here. Need to send some art. Oh, Where's the enemy? Oh, the enemy is on the, the next container. I also go there then. Like everyone else is busy on somewhere else, but here we are. Alright, this is the place. Stop that! Oh my god, what the hell is that? I just shot a storm force by accident. I just lost my shield by the way. Oh well. This is very chaotic, to be honest. I'm not going to lie. <laughs> oh, wow, this is really. Holy shit! Hello? Oh, oh I want that one. Another win. That's a lot of wins. Alright, like, let's send some parts in. This Camber Diego is actually a good build for that line. I know! I know, it's surprising to be honest. Like, making it work is one thing, but. Yeah, that is, that is something. There is two units like here, and then the unit number two here, which is Marika's... What about? So let's go there. Ah, sure, sure. Okay, what is it? Oh, it's, it's on the other ground. It's really like that. Hello? Team 
I love it actually. Uh, that move is so stylish, I love it. Oh, there's a lot of new parts here actually. Humphur, uh, Superior Gundam, Brick Dias, Stamen, Folding Shield, and Goof. Alright. Now! What do you want to build? Oh yeah, finish him! Alright, what do you want to build? So the first part is Mac Knife Lag. Do I even have that though? That's the question. Uh, 
I'm just trying to make it a base look here so we can do a bunch of stuff easily. Alright, first suggestion was a Mac Life Whack on 1 100. Okay. What is Rakonista in G? I do have it, I think. I mean, someone asked it before. Um, that was Avocado. In, that was Red asking it. So yeah, here we are. <laughs> oh boy. Okay, what what's next? What's next? <laughs> what's next? Oh god, what is this? <laughs> it doesn't have the crush me though. Well, it has. It actually has it. It has photon bomb. All right, go ahead. The rest is 144. Oh my god. <laughs> <laughs> oh wow so big sexy leg well if you can call it sexy even and then everything else is just small so yeah the question is what 144 part that we're going to put on this thing I think my knife anything is just questionable. Ah, uh, not really. The head is nice, to be honest. The head is pretty okay. But, hmm. Yeah, I think the only thing that is okay is either the head and that's it, isn't it? So you know, whatever, right? Throw in a chesty chest. What's what's that supposed to mean? <laughs> a gun tank? <laughs> oh, that's so weird. Oh my god. A, a ball. <laughs> a ball is pretty uh, normal. To be honest, the gun tank though, like holy shit. This is what it looks like when you skip like days. This is what basic, what it looks like when you skip like days. Okay, easy egg. Hang on, let me check. Let Let's see how it looks. This is actually pretty okay. I know weird though still, but it's okay. <laughs> what? Do you want to use this or the gun tank? The gun tank is just stupid to be honest. <laughs> uh... This is absolutely ridiculous, I'm not going to lie. Do you guys have any any other suggestion before we lock into this easy egg body? No? Anyone? Oh my god, we're going to use this. Oh, uh, so a waifu build is out of the window now. <laughs> yeah. There is no way we're going to make a wife out of this, I think. Uh, it's just a meme build now. <laughs> if you have any suggestion, that get him some real fierce arms. Ooh, fierce arms. I think I know one thing that we can do, but it's gonna be weird. Trust me. There it is. 
Look. <laughs> this is real fierce, you know? Look, look at how massive that manipulator there. Hopefully hat will nice. Great displeasure, but <laughs> oh my god. Yeah, this is practically what it is. When you skip black days, this is how it looks like. Do you want me to use this or something else, by the way? <laughs> oh my god... <laughs> oh, this is just dumb! Great! Okay, that was the, the, the previous chat, but... Oh my god. That's why, Kate, you never have to skip like days. This is what will happen to you if when you skip like days. Oh my god, it's so weird. Uh, it. Like. It's. It fits somehow, but it's so weird. You know what? No one says anything, so might as well. The hell is Kubele? Oh, that's Zeta, right? Hang on. Uh, soft field. I don't even got a comment for this one ship. And it's going to work. Hopefully. Hopefully. But it's Zeta. Do I even have a Kubele? Kubele on Zeta or double Zeta? It's on double Zeta, isn't it? Is it? Yeah, Kubele is on double Zeta, okay. Oh, I don't have the Kubele. Oh, I do, ha I do have it. Oh, wait, that's the body, not the hat. I can't believe I don't have Kubele hat. Wow, that's really something. Give me a moment. We need to buy that. Like, it's like a muscle man without leg like, day on stilts. Yes. It's dumb. This is Kubele Mark 2, though. Do we go with Kubele Mark 2 or Kubele? I mean, it's practically the same hat, so I guess anything can go, right? Is there any difference at all? It has skill seal on the original one. Part 2 one has... Well, it's just the same. Just different color. Right then. Let's pick them up. It's practically the same, so yeah. Musk is barfing in his cockpit right now, seeing Mac knife legs on this that kind of build. Yes, because it's not even slim. Like Mac knife is really slim. I mean, to be to be fair, I just realized something about the the Mac knife design here. This leg is basically the grip on a folding knife, isn't it? Hopefully the backpack can be wing this kind of stuff. Hmm. Wings kind of stuff. Okay, uh, let's see. You have to go with 144 of course. Yakushiki Jaeger is not a wing, with that's not a wing, Shinbusha doesn't have one, perfect doesn't have one, Fidar. Meh. Uh, Lupus Rex is not a wing. Not a, that's somewhat a wing, but. Um, I'm not sure. Do we go with this wing? I mean, it's not exactly a wing, but 
It looks like one at least. Uh, where is the wing? Of this has wing. That's not a wing. That's not a wing. Double or diver. It's not even the sky. Gundam wing backpack. Oh god. <laughs> we're gonna do an actual wing, aren't we? I mean, I personally want something a bit more mechanical, but you ask for that, I guess. I mean, we can go with the Strike Freedom backpack, for example. It has Super Dragoon. Uh, Destiny, which has a bunch of stuff. A wing backpack, yeah, that kind of does it too. You know what, let's have a look on... Wing and Lesswaltz here. Fuck that, that's Proto Z, bro. Eh. Honestly, this end up looks more normal than I was expecting <laughs> if we just use this wing. I'm not going to lie, this is just normal. <laughs> Something buggy kind of wings. Buggy kind of That kind of reminds me, do I have oh I have master. Isn't this technically a wing as well? <laughs> no, you mean the high new one? I mean if it's just no, that's not exactly a wing, is it? It's just a bunch of you know, funnel. You know what I mean? But we can go with the high new. Oh my god, the hat is gonna count on the wing. <laughs> Master wing. It's not exactly a wing, it's more like a cape, but it's wing though, still. Master wing. <laughs> I'm not going to say that. <laughs> Uh, uh, you know what, I'm going to say it, Master Wang. <laughs> it fits though, I'm not going to lie, this is fits. Like, the leg is like that, and the wing is like that as well. That, that somewhat fits the bill. Or how bizarre it looks, you know? Oh, uh, this... This is more like a jester, to be honest. Oh yeah, everyone is agreeing with the master backpack here. <laughs> oh, master Asia will be so proud. All right, that's the entire gun club done. I think, yeah. All right, let's put on some equipment. Starting maybe from the shield. Keep it for me, please. We already got the mag knife legs for the other guys, so please. Okay, okay, okay. <laughs> we'll keep it, we'll keep it. <laughs> How about the shield? Mm, this is the hard part because... This is what protects us from danger, you know? Oh, my shield is really nice. <laughs> oh, this is so bizarre. Buck Warrior! <laughs> oh, you should start thinking about the name for that. Insecticider! <laughs> oh my god, the curve shield is actually works really nice. So, the other two audience? They don't seem to talk though. I mean, they should just stop talking if you, they want to. Ask me to build with something, you know? Do you want a weapon, maybe? Guys, the other two viewers, please? <laughs> I mean, I'm chill. 
punch with his exoskeletal mic. <laughs> oh man. Anyone? Do I do it a shield? <laughs> I mean, if no one's really tall, it might as well just be you too here. Might as well. Any shield suggestion? A shield booster. Uh, this is really useless to be honest. <laughs> the enhanced fire machine actually has a beam. Well, some kind of short blade, kind of nice. A short blade. Hmm. Short blade. Like a race blade or a claw. Hmm. The thing is, I don't think there is a claw in this game. Oh yeah, short blade. Oh, this thing is terrible, but it's short though. It's ever pretty small as well. Go blade then. Yeah, I mean go hit saber is actually kind of work. Not the uh, that one, this one. But we can maybe look have a look around a little bit more before we decide what kind of blade that we're going to use. Maybe there is a smaller one, like a dual knife, for example. Actually, that that sounds like a good idea. Oh my god, the Ainu swords look so small. This <laughs> is just right. Uh, let's see. Does he have anything small? God, he looks like a buck bodybuilder that was done by once. What's done by, by the way? Can you explain it to me? The GN sword. <laughs> the GN sword looks so weird. Oh my god. It's it's inside the hand. Completely. What the hell? GN sword 5. This is the closest thing that you can get as a claw. Just a single silent claw. It's dumb. Lost of Barbatos. A claw looks maybe a beginning 30 Ganda, but it's not small though. Simple katana. It's Saber from Ifrit Custom. Holy shit, that looks that looks awesome. Give me Saber Barzab, hit shot out. Hmm, there is a lot of good dual weapon here actually. Armor <laughs> look, look how tiny that is! It's just a toothpick for this guy. It's not even a knife, it's a toothpick for this guy. Oh, that's just too big. Oh, this is even smaller. I don't know, both of them look small. Oh, it should be better than mine. It's an alt. Anime about man fighting in a box style max. Ooh. Okay, interesting. That's just a sword. <laughs> oh my god, this is just a toothpick. <laughs> That's alright, I guess. <laughs> what is this? That's so small. This thing is so small! A uh, gen sort of somehow looks right. That's not, that's too big. I found it's actually a... Uh... 
There is a twin maze here. I forgot about that. Rubber type rhino, right? <laughs> Alright, what do you want to pick? We still have some more. Um, do you want me to keep the beginning 30, I guess? Beam sword axe, tomahawk. Like, this stuff is just looks right to be honest because it's a long rod. I'm oh, not the hit fan, but yeah. Like, there is quite a lot of good options though. Oh, this looks like a super robo now. Who is using this? Is this a oh, this is Epion Sword. I just realized that. Oh, the flame looks nice though. The beam looks nice. <laughs> I'm not going to lie. The short blade. Okay, the super short blade. Where is it? We have three different one. We have Armor Schneider from Strike. Oh my god, that's so small. We have Folding Razor and Folding Razor Anti Armor Knife. And we have the Ar another Armor Shider, but this time it's from Blue Frame. Which one? Oh, the damage is, the damage is so small. <laughs> which which knife do we pick? <laughs> which knife do we pick? It's it's a short blade, that's for sure. Really, a really short one for this kind of unit as well. But, alright. Which one, which one, which one you going to pick? The blades are so short, it would make them look like he's pummeling the enemies instead. Might be more effective that he is just pummeling the enemy instead, to be honest. I'm not going to lie. <laughs> I'm not sure about the shorter one. Hmm. It's kinda long. I mean, they're practically the same length, so I guess the, the one with the strike here is actually going to fit well with your description. Oh my god, it's so small. <laughs> oh, it's so small, look at that. Holy shit. <laughs> Alright, um... Next, gun. Or shield. What do you want? For this, <sighs> what kind of this gun that you want? Anyone? Right? Matthew? We have a lot of guns that we can use, including the beam spray gun. <laughs> shield rebow, small firearm. Oh, okay. So let's go with the shield first. The rebow. Do I have not have that? Hopefully I have. Oh, I do have it. Oh wow, that's actually kinda alright. Alright then. For the gun, we're going to go with the small firearm. Holy shit. <laughs> Beam spray gun! <laughs> oh, oh my god, it's just a, a squirter. It's just a squirter here. Let's, let's have a look around. Maybe there is a smaller one. <laughs> That's just too big, come on. Beam rifle, anti-1. 
That's really with dirt right now. So can't suggest that fast. Sorry, okay. That's fine, that's fine. It's alright. Don't worry. Ah, this is too big, girl. Come on. We need a small firearm. Oh my god. Ah, <laughs> uh, come on. It's getting bigger now. That's still big. Come on now. Big Buckman, small weapon. Jim, it is small. Yes, I know, right? But I'm pretty sure there's a stuff that is smaller than the Jim. Like maybe from double O. I remember there is a really small firearm, but it's a dual gun. Oh my god, that's, that's hilarious actually. The Stark Jagan. <laughs> the Stark Jagan is just small as well. It even looks smaller than the spray gun somehow. What the hell? <laughs> the Peacock Smasher, that's just too big, come on. That's still big. Small but hits hard. I wonder. <laughs> like this maybe? This is pretty small? I guess... The strike shooter? I mean, this can be one, I guess. Um, hand beam gun. That's pretty big actually. For what it is. Energy and rifle. Is there anything smaller? Most sit units has a really big gun, so can't do much about it. Even that's still big. Okay, that's just too big. Same as that. <laughs> Ah, uh, there's a sword with beam rifle. Small arms. Imagine a small man holding a P2A. I know, it's so small. So anyway, I start blasting. Dots rifle. Eh, that's a little big. Dots gun, stungo rifle, legless rifle, beam shotgun, oh, it's still pretty big. Come on, now where is this small little gun here? Beam rifle, rifle, enhanced beam rifle, lightning gundam, beam rifle short barrel. Ah, oh, this is still pretty huge though. Beam rifle shorty, oh my god. Remember when you described, imagine a small guy with the P228? This is basically it! <laughs> is there anything smaller than this? I don't think so. I don't think there is anything smaller than this. Yeah, even the high end of GB Parfum is bigger. Oh, this is actually smaller. The GN Beam Pistol 2 is even smaller than the Beam Rifle Shorty. Oh my god, it's so small. Oh, that's just too big, come on. He gunner! <laughs> yes! GN Cannon. Magella Top Cannon. Okay, anything else is bigger at this point. There's nothing smaller than that. Alright, that's practically everything is done to be honest. Oh, we have a lot of range skills, so we're going to build this as a range unit. Yeah, let's make it into a range unit this time. Um, in a frame. I want to put the gunner, but this is really fragile. The matrix. Wait, what dual cannon hits different? Put it back on. What? Dual cannon hits different. Oh, 
Okay. Um, which block can can the Gen cannon? This one? Is it this one that you're talking about? <sighs> okay, the beam scatter. Well, not beam scatter shot. The GN cannon. Oh boy. I tried this. This thing is. <laughs> This thing sucks to be honest, but oh well. <laughs> it's only shot once and reload. Yes, I know. But that's the point about this build. It's not to be good. It's to be problematic. <laughs> Let's go with this. We're going to mostly use the melee, I'm pretty sure. And some EX. More than the gun. He says as he pumps his biceps. <laughs> yeah, I know, right? This is what it looks like when you skip like days, but you still go to gym. All right, let's paint it first. First thing first, though. Let's change the color for everything for now. To the primer gray, so we can see everything really nicely. Um, we want this. That daggers also have small damage, so good luck. Oh yeah, I really need that. <laughs> Trust me. Oh boy, let's start with the body. All right, here's the question. What do you want me to color this? The main color. This Buckman is winning me over. Let's go. Oh, you actually like it somehow. <laughs> oh, wow. That's gonna be fun. I like. What do you want me to color this? Like, this is not for a look. Jade Phantom color. Oh. You remember that from the mass builder, aren't you? So a green one. So, oh, we're going to make it green. Ooh, aliens. Okay, both of you agree it's gonna be green. Alright then, I'll make it work. Okay, let's see. Yeah, we need a darker green first, that's for sure. Let's make a dark green like this. Um, save it like here. And from there... This still haven't done yet. We need to make this green. A tad darker, but not too much to fit the bill of two tone color. Well, maybe like two. Yeah, that's good enough. That's pretty much the jade color. Green and dark green. Well, yes, that's what I did, actually, but. Maybe the green is actually a bit a bit more darker than this. Yeah, it's close to black. It's an interesting combination because it's a two-tone, but not really two-tone. You know what I'm saying? So it's not really obvious the, how the color looks. This game got glow? Well, no, unfortunately there is no glow color like in Mass Builder though. 
as cool as that is, but it it's not. I, I kind of wish there is, but well, painting on this game is not that advanced. Like I wish you can make a you, your own glow on some parts, but y you can't. That's the problem. <laughs> Alright, the next piece will be brighter like that. That's also need to be brighter. Yeah, the two tone works, but we cannot add glow color, unfortunately. If the part has the glowing part, yes, but it's but none for this. Yes, that's the unfortunate thing about that, right? Alright, that works. I mean, color is pretty similar, but it's you know it's too tall. Like if you if I color it like this, like that's the stripes right there. Yeah, you can see very clearly it's a two different color, and I like that kind of design. It's it's so subtle yet nice. Yet it's it shows, you know. Like the small bits is actually very pronounced. That's it's lovely. See what I mean? How about the lighter green be lighter? Making it more contrast, I see. Yeah, we can make that work actually. Hang on. Right? Like that? And then maybe. Maybe like this. Like a neon green, so it's really pronounced in terms of color. Yeah, this works right. So I'm going to keep it on the other part right now, just in case you guys change your mind about the bright green color here. It's actually really pronounced. I actually like it, the neon green on this. Like, it just says, yeah. It, it's not glowing, but it glows. Oh, it actually works really well. This is monster energy, to be honest, but oh well. <laughs> Oh yeah, it works, it works. Works like a charm. Make it to 100. No, 100 will be too much, to be honest. I mean, if we try here. Uh, what is the arm again? If we try to make it 100, that will be too bright. It's... I mean, it's alright, but should we? Like... This without the one okay, it's still one hundred. Like this is just right in my opinion. If it if I put it one hundred, it's just gonna be too bright. That's my opinion. But if you want it, sure, I guess. I mean, like, I cannot do anything about it. <laughs> what is this? Oh, 
That's the only time I have pleather color. It is. It should be dark gray, that's what I should. Yeah, monster energy. Also, this booster panel will just color it with the pop color. Anything else should work as it is, right? Oh uh, yeah, this looks really nice actually. Like this is surprising because this is just you guys that build it technically speaking. But it works. That's what's important here. I need to color the skirt first though. I really want the separation to be there, that's the problem with the hip. Maybe not. I just go with that for now. Nice, Pop Ice favorite food. <laughs> Spinach, yes. Make it and make dark color and then the secondary color here that will be the brighter one oh ah, yeah that works nice actually yeah bright color crotch Oh yeah, that looks good actually. <laughs> I'm kind of surprised how good looking this build is, to be honest. This is interesting. Because I wasn't expecting this would be this great, but it is. it is. You know, this somehow feels like a disaster and more to the kind of like the cleaner kind of build. I know! Like it's somehow it's a clean build. Somewhat. It's interesting how this works. <laughs> like Supposedly we are supposed to ruin the build, but it's actually working really nice here. Bike one. Oh yes, look at that. And we can try to make this bike as well if we want. Do we make it this bike or just keep it dark? Make it, should we make it bright instead? Yeah, I mean bike one is actually looks nice. I'm not going to lie, if we make it bright, it actually looks nice. Dark? How about you, Matthew? Like, both looks nice, you know, but, you know, let's wait for that. Let's focus on the other stuff here. Yes, got back and I agree to whatever he said. Okay. I mean, I'm talking about this on the front here. Um, where is it? There it is. This front right here. can make it dark or make it bright 
So it looks like it's an attachment, but on this one, it's also looks like it just has a bright green nose. It looks nice, but both ways looks nice to be honest. Yeah, that's small bits. What do you think? Bike or dark? Both of them looks nice to be honest, I'm not going to lie. Like this would look more flush to the side, but... Make it looks like it has a green nose. Should be like has a pincer mouth, so kind of contrast color. Red? Huh. Interesting idea. Oh wow! Oh wow! Actually, actually, that's interesting in a way. I mean, the red is really striking. But yeah, what do you think? It actually works quite well. I know! What is going on? Usually internet build is not this good. Hello? So how you guys make th makes things look great? What the hell? How do you guys make this look nice? <laughs> Oh my god, that's nice. I'm just looking around here. Yeah, but this thing looks really nice somehow. You know what, let's just go with the red one since... You think it looks nice? I do like to think it looks nice as well, like... For some reason it has a rat on it, but it just works. I like the end part to just be dark green. Red dark frog. Ah, interesting idea. All right, he already looks much more mean now. Extra red. Hmm. I mean, we can do something like this. Chipping here and there, you know. So you can see some texture here and there, and maybe some extra damage like that. Something like this, like it's a battle hardened unit. Some bullet holes, some scratches. Like, that's the only texturing that I could think of. Looks more separated, like his actual teeth or something. Yeah, I guess it kind of work. You know, let's just keep it. Um, uh, right. That is done. The oh, backpack. Actually, good looking. I know! What are you guys doing? <laughs> you guys making things look so good somehow. How the hell do you guys do this? <laughs> I have no idea. Okay, the wing may, may need to be a bright green more. Because we already have so much dark green. We need to contrast it a little bit in the back here. That should be a bike green. Actually, no, that's not going to work. That's still not going to be dark green.
bike grid part of bike grid bright yellow okay it it won't be able to be a clear material but it's not oh well you can't do everything right correct bright yellow what does it even work oh that's so weird I mean yellow is alright but with the overall body looks like already with one color I just can't, I can't accept that for some reason Oh, this should also be bright red. Maybe with this yellow on the edge here, this works actually. Like this, not the main color. It's gonna be bright. I say light pink for the insides. Light pink? What? <laughs> um. Okay. But um, you know, let's. Nah, that light pink doesn't work actually. That's surprising. Yeah, let's just keep it that way, shall we? Like light pink would doesn't doesn't feel like it fits with the coloring. Yellow does because it's part of the color mix. The green is part of the color mix. Well, I guess red and green is actually making yellow, right? Not sure. Um. Anyway, let's go to the shield. Yeah, I mean, I know it's swing, but I feel like yellow is fine. Oh, this is where things get dicey here. Um. How about this? Um, the axe here, which we're not going to use anyway. Just like that, and the barrel, that's where the gun color works. Energy blast! <laughs> He swings up the color of Monster Energy, which he sips every morning before a wrap at the gym. <gasps> that doesn't sound healthy. <laughs> but oh well, he he does he. I'm not I'm not going to judge. I'm just saying it's not that healthy. Oh uh, well. Like his cannons have chrome barrels and black craft material for the plating, so they look like gym equipment. Ooh. Basically the the base color from the previous one, okay. Let's go with the cannon first. Barrel chrome. The bright chrome of the silver chrome. This is actually so looks right. Oh well. And then the black plating. Black plating just matte color. This one because it's just a plating, right? A gym equipment.
from a scroll. Oh my god. <laughs> Alright, uh, let's go with that. Oh my god, it's so bright. Yeah, that looks like a, a, sti a steel color, that's for sure. What is this color? Oh, it's the fan. You know, let's keep it. Let's keep that one a silver because this is part of the chrome experience. Because that's the fan. Oh my god. Yeah, the fan is shiny with alongside with the barrel. What the hell is this thing? <laughs> The cannons have weight inside them, so he can steal in battle. Buck warrior. <laughs> oh my god, what is this? <laughs> Looks so good and weird at the same time. Alright, now for the knife. Well, regular black is fine, I guess, for the grip. This one just a silver. Okay, maybe silver. This is a matte black. Yeah, that looks like a really expensive knife, isn't it? Oh god, what have you made here? <laughs> it's so good. Anyway. About this thing? What? Um, I don't see any glow color on this. But oh well. You know what? I'm just going to turn it off. I'm not sure about it. What's that about? It's 12 a.m. after work. It's a miracle we got this gut set of ideas cobbled together somehow. I know. Alright, what's the eyes color do you want? What's the eye color that you want here? Maybe uh, a deep dark red like this? Or... Yellow? It's Hawkins magic. Oh, eyes. Yes, eyes. How can magic? I, saw, I like the sound of that. <laughs> Could be blood color. Basically, this one. This is particularly blood color, isn't it? Like that. Our pig, really? Basically, either that or the default Zaku color. Then. So either, either this or this. Because the brighter it is, the harder the color to be look. Most of the time, at least in my opinion. It's so weird how things work here, to be honest. I'm gonna go with that. But it's just white from afar, because it's just shining so brightly. Kinda dig the red though. Dark pink. Like this? It's still glowy though. Looks like the after effect of monster energy. <laughs> it looks good, but the way you're saying it though. This thing looks really angry. I'm, I'm, I'm not gonna lie, this thing looks really angry. This is really 
<laughs> oh boy. Yeah, I think that's it, right? I'm not sure if we can do any anything further than this. I mean, we don't even need decal because decal doesn't fit the color at all. Lower the brightness of the pink. Damn, man, what can I say? Anyway, let me try to lower the brightness of the pink. With the dark pink, it looks like this. I I zip the energy whenever I'm losing. <laughs> like the dark pink also works, you know. Oh yeah, which one? Red or pink? Because both of both looks good, and the only two that folds are you two, so. It's hard to justify one of the other, you know? Because both looks good! <sighs> so yeah, what, what do you guys want? The red or the pink one? Flip a coin, I guess. Hat is blood. Okay, where is my coin? <laughs> So yeah, there is no hat here, but there is pictures and numbers. I'm going to flip a coin. If it's pictures, that will be blood. If it's not, it's pink. All right, I already flip. Okay, we're going with the blood line color. We're going red. We're going red. Alright, this is basically done. Look at that. Like, look at it. Good lord, that's... That's... That's very really menacing. <laughs> you know what? What's interesting? This is not the first time I actually make a bug or insect-based unit on this game. Insect-based gunpla. Because if we go to oh, where is it? Right here, the Queen Jacket. The Queen Jacket is my Bumblebee based unit. And then we have the second one basically in the series, which is this one. Look at that. What's the nearest to that? Oh, it's just that. Okay, let's switch the position from that to this so we know these two are around the same series go for the name Matthew yeah you should these legs are like the flat fish in SpongeBob insecticider oh hmm we need a number store a model number It's already pretty long though. I don't know if we could. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7. Okay, we could. We could. We can. We can. Do you want a model number? Model number? Do you have any suggestion for the model number that we are going to use here? R34. I mean, yeah, it's, it's nice. Mm. 
maybe not just R34 because that's really ambiguous because we have a car with that number series we have a certain pleasuring comics with that numbers as well so maybe not just R we, we have to add some more an insect long range maybe ILR ILR numbers okay we can only get two numbers by the way we can only have two numbers so what's the number? Because it's really full at that point. I mean, we can, well, number four now, thirty-four, for example. But we can change it, but only to num two digit, twenty-three. Bw six oh nine. That's much. That makes more sense as well because buck warrior six oh nine. 66 also can work for pumping biceps <laughs> uh, you got the idea there nice 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 now the song I will just Pick myself because I don't want to get copyrighted if I play it too long for you guys so I'll try to pick the good one and hopefully I don't get copyright claim <laughs> that obviously it's something that sounds a little not that, not that. Not unicorn, obviously. Let's cross both. Make sure the theme song hits. I'm trying. That's not the way to go. Not that one. No, there is not such a heroic song. That's not right. I mean, I know this is agile, but not not for that. It's not a warrior. Counter attack. Counter attack works actually. Yeah, because it's it's a really fast paced one. Yeah, let's go with that. All right, it's official. Insect decider. The ILR insect long range sixty six. Insect decider. Basically, the rifle of the Queen Jacket. I think the Queen Jacket is a melee, right? Oh, it's a subject frame. It's a it's a hit and run build. Okay. Oh, this is not the hit and run build. All right, let's try this. Since this is a bug based or insect based unit, let's start with the jungle. Um, let's bring someone else. Uh, Ryoko and... Uh, let's keep it Yui. 
We already got two max in a series of insects, yes. Oh boy, look at that. That thing looks so dangerous somehow. And this the wing flaps! <laughs> what? The wing flaps! Guys, the wings open up! It's still running! I mean... <laughs> oh my god! That's really insect-like! It's so slow though! Somehow it felt really slow! Oh, the damage up close is really good. The gun actually works really well when you're up close, so you don't have to worry too much about it. Yeah, this is weirdly working. What the hell? <laughs> it doesn't make any sense. So how this work? I mean, not by far, but you're close enough. That up close actually hits really hard, but we are really fragile as well. Will he be, be menacing though? He is! In terms of damage, he is, this is a glass cannon basically. This is a glass cannon because it, it hits hard, but when it got hit, it suffers a lot, just like an actual insect. No! The hell is gone? The hell just gone? Did you see that? The hell just gone? Did you? What? That's ridiculous. That's ridiculous. <laughs> it's a glass cannon that hits really hard. This is what it is. Like it's ridiculous to of damage. Look, this is here. It's gone. <laughs> this thing is ridiculous. I love it. It relies a lot on the skill though. This thing's really ridiculous. Yeah, it relies a lot on the axe, but it works. I'm still alive somehow. This thing is ridiculous. The armor Snyder just stupid. It doesn't work. Everything else though, the gun works really well. The power number may be small, but it does its part. Because how it works. 
周は間に合うのかそれは俺のものにする予定のパンチだぞ返せこれやりますやれればいるわいこれは大きなポイントですこの程度のクエスト造作もないな次に行こう。そうそう。アルマシャンでやすわ。ああ、わいつ。スパーニングヒール。スパーニングヒール。回収に成功するとは。さすがだな。ああ、俺はなるほど、セックスなの。ポイント獲得です。さあ。あ、ちょっと、ちょっと、ちょっと、ちょっと、ちょっと、ちょっと、ちょっと、ちょっと、ちょっと、ちょっと、ちょっと、ちょっと、Well, it's not if it, the purpose if the shiner is suddenly good. Yeah, that's true. <laughs> We just spit acid. <laughs> Alright, let's destroy <laughs> Grandpa here. We just ignore the shot. That's for K. Well, yeah, you just chip damage. Just chip damage. Just chip damage everywhere. <laughs> It's not even me that killed it. Try to change the frame with such a frame. Snyder is just the beat up version of the massive upper t a c I mean, if I change to the such a frame, I think the damage will, output will be lower. I feel. I mean, we can try. I'm just gonna have to play away. Bunch of blue-dust team boxing. Where's the enemy, by the way? Yeah, the, the massive upper cut is just the cannon. <laughs> Yeah, let's try to, to use the structure frame for a little bit after this. We'll see how that works. Because this is really slow. Yeah, this is really slow. We need, if we want to be a bug, we need to be fast, right? Yo, buddy! Yeah, it's lost. A lot of its health. Oh well, I died. I wasn't expecting that. He used burst. I I I I thought I already activated the skill seal, but I really did not. Is that Zagaki? I don't think so. That's the other guy, I think. Dumbo cannon. Damn it all, seriousness. Yeah, I know, right? Oh, come on. Where is, where is the, the last guy? We were trying to find Sakaki, but we cannot find him anywhere. Also, what is she doing there? I mean, the t r u s t e r capacity is really large. 
Vehicle. Okay, the, the AI is broken. I don't know what's going on here. Let's show though. Again. I keep getting destroyed by that. But yeah. He actually much better than what I've and finished in during the build. Yeah, somehow it works, isn't it? <laughs> Who would expect that, right? I wasn't expecting that, to be honest. Okay, let's try the, to use Deception Frame, so it moves faster, like an actual bug. Because this is just too slow. How much of a smith does it have? It doesn't have a lot, that's why it's so slow. Alright, there is the Deception Frame that we need. Um, right, less likely to be targeted, so trans expansion, reduce damage while recovering. Let's go with movement speed up, boost speed up. Let's try that. Let's try to move fast. Somehow we made a build that revolved around the Mac knife legs. Yes! Somehow we do that. We, we wasn't expecting that, but it works. Alright, let's invade the classroom. Uh, let's just keep it going. Okay, let's try to fly fast. Long live the legs! <laughs> yes, nice legs, isn't it? And leg is 1100, not 144. Oh, it's so much faster! I don't know about the damage though. Oh, this thing is really quick. But everyone is chasing me, so it's not good. Oh, the damage is so much slower, though. It's not as good as before. I have to rely more on the... The damage is not, not that great if I use this frame. We need to be the gla the slow glass cannon, that's for sure. And I try to dash with the attack. I think that's the way to do it. I mean it's fast, but the damage is not good. Yeah, it doesn't even kill now. On that train. I have to rely a lot with the skill. Yeah, 
Yeah, that took quite some time before we get the kill, but... Yeah, I have to spam so much on this skill just to get a kill, which is less than ideal. This game huge down with of breaker tree, I know, but this is the only gun breaker that I have. Yeah, we're going back with the gun of frame, that's for sure. <laughs> Oh, what the hell? I lost so many things here. Oh, what the hell? Once I got the battle of pressure for PC1, I kind of doubt it will ever happen, to be honest. Ah, uh, yeah, we need to get a frame. Yeah. But have you seen the battle log announcement? I'm kind of excited for that. I can't even kill. <laughs> I just chip damage off of chip damage even more. Finally. <laughs> We just ship damage! Look at it! I mean, I still can kill. But... Yeah. <laughs> We're just okay. Oh, it's the double KO. I lost my item. Yeah, I don't have much there. But they're gonna, yeah, but they're gonna the operation. I don't think I will. It will happen because the way the game works. I mean, unless you want the aiming system like World of Tanks, which is not exactly ideal for that game, where there is a smaller reticle so you can aim. Eh, the, the entire game is designed around console controller. So yeah. I don't think it will be ideal. It's one of those games that you don't, you can't really port to PC easily. So you know, it's kind of hard to do. And also, speaking of which, uh, let's 
go back to the gun frame here real quick. Um, the battle log doesn't even mention this game, by the way. So none of the character here will be in the upcoming Gundam Breaker battle log if you follow that. So yeah. I've been looking forward for the battle log and I'm planning to make a video about the suggestion for the future Gundam Breaker. Which obviously the first thing that I will say will be, yeah let's go back to Gundam Breaker 3 first because that's the best game. Use that as a base and then start developing from there. Which is basically the easiest thing to do but I don't know how they will port it. Who knows about that but yeah. But after that I'll put an actual suggestion for the future game well, especially for the pvp because what we're playing here is the pvp only but we can play it with the bots just like we're playing with counter strike for example but the thing is the campaign is so underhanded it's just meh oh so, yeah um, he's a bodybuilder that drinks most of every day and his name is Insecticider. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> this bodybuilder, man. It's just too strong. I mean, it's slow compared to the Queen Jacket, which I'm going to show you real quick after this. Now let's go with um, the space area here. Oh, it'd be all cool then. This thing is a complete menace, to be honest. I mean, it's slow, it easily dies, but it, when, it, when it hits you, especially up close, oh boy, you don't, you're not going to like it. <laughs> you, you just can't like being hit by this thing. And it's pretty big compared to these two bosses. Yeah, I'm focusing on leveling first for now. Uh, maybe not. Oh, I have to drop Yeah, it's an absolute glass cannon here. I'm going to die. I'm going to die here. Yep, I died. I mean, it's strong in terms of attack, but gank, gank up like that, it won't work. It's either die be a bug without his energy. Yeah. <laughs> okay, what's up? Yeah. Yeah, it, it just removed all the parts rather right easily. This is bad. This is really ridiculous. You want to deal with your, your, remove your enemy parts easily? This gun is the way to go. But you have to be really close though. What the hell is this? Oh, 
ステージギミックが解放されますよ天気を変えるチャンスかもしれませんいやーだこのクエストを私に譲ってもらおう I just do プレイヤースタイル撃破されましたケンカーバンチョーエクスプレイビアンサイドアライトクエストがある。クエスト失敗ですね。あそこでまたデイナムクエストでは、ポイントが取れないでしょうか。やべえ。クエスト忘れてた。なんでアニメーションにするやいいんだよ。ない。最強で。第三勢力がギミック周辺に出ました。このクエストをクリアするとギミックが使用可能になります。こんなクエスト一瞬で終わらせてやるぜ。ほら、これが、ダイ。ほら、ほら、ほら、ほら、ほら、ほら、ほら、ほら、ほら、ほら、ほら、ほら、ほら、ほら、ほら、ほら、ほら、ほら、ほら、ほら、ほら、ほら、ほら、ありがとうございます。ありがとうございます。ありがとうございます。ありがとうございます。ありがとうございます。Seriously, I lost my knife here. Um, what the hell? That's right. I lost my knife, so I'm just going to borrow this go custom sword game for a little while. I have no idea. <laughs> Honestly, I have no idea as well. I just got hit. Oh, my teammate just recovered the part t h e r Come on. Oh, the recovery is so slow. You know, if you look at it, this is kind of the real spin of the buff. In robot size, like it's fast in b u c few if it's smaller, but this is big, so that's why it's slow, isn't it? Oh, wow, do you know what I mean by the scanner? I just died. やれるときにやれることをするのが本当の変身いやガンプラ見るだけでいうものがプレイヤー2撃破されました I'm going to show you it's rifle the rifle is not much better than anyway but 
I died! I died just being by being there. Holy shit. Player one, Game Pass. It just instantly dies to boss. I won. Uh, it's so fragile, it just dies. <laughs> like a fly getting s s swatted, you know? Oh, yeah, he's back. Yep, it's gone. But it hits hard. It hits hard, but it gets hit hard as well. <laughs> I don't even think about the objective right now. Wait, this is my GN cannon from earlier. What the hell? The enemy doesn't even hold a single objective. It's ridiculous. Please don't shoot me with your... Razor, please. I'm sure though, but it's only, only 5 seconds left. Ah, it doesn't die. It's not that. Uh, <laughs> not much here, but it's all right. Hey, got the wrench mace though. That's nice. Okay, let me just show you how the queen jacket works. That's basically another insect style or box style unit. Except this one is my original design, in a way. So just look at it. This thing uses Dot's gun. It wasn't Zulu hat, that's why it looks like that. Barbatos fourth form, that's why it's so fragile on the middle right there. The Kubi Mark II. Arch Gundam Black, which, well, it has Jian Fang. The Kubi Backpack, which has another funnel. Like, I have so much fun. I have enough funnel with this thing, to be honest. And then the Jian Shield Kibios to catch some enemies off guard. And that's it. It's actually fairly balanced, but mostly on the range side because there is three different range weapon the X skill and one is defensive one is just open control and plus the only melee is just the GN shield so this one is using a searcher frame but somehow this searcher frame unit has a 1000 range power so it's much stronger than the uh, the other the GN cannon but the thing is, it's a single shot, unlike the Gen Cannon. The Gen Cannon, the only reason why the Gen Cannon is really uh, small is because uh, the only reason it's that it's because it's just small in terms of what is it. Like it has so much spread, so that's why it's strong. But it's the damage is 
small. Yeah, I mean, it's fair. The, the gun is small, but if you get up close, it's really strong. As long as you're using the gunner frame. But if you don't, oh boy. This is a lot faster, as you can see. I already go up here. <laughs> Look how fast this is coming to the other one, right? Yeah, you, you, you shoot one, but you can just the machine gun. It's much more flexible in a way, but it just lands. And that's a problem, in a way, this. The funnel is basically a uh, stun. Well, works much better than the previous one, of course, but I can make it make the other one work as long as I get close. This one is much more flexible and much faster. Heroin. <laughs> yeah, you can say that it, this is the heroin. Because it's a queen. And it just us lands because it's a stinger, right? I grabbed the wrong one. Damn, she makes the buck warrior feels like a sidekick. Because it's much stronger, that's the problem. This is a little too strong, to be and it's fast, and it flies really far as well. But you know, the funny thing is, if you think about anime, right? It's always the girl who is actually stronger. So makes sense, right? In a way. Hang on, you need to die. この<笑><笑> I mean, you know, the... Heroin is fell in love with the protagonist regardless of their power. I end up stuck. I 
ーパーツをダッシュこのまま回収できれば高ポイント獲得ですおお、あいつが倒れた。わお。それはファンの。やめよ、ゆい、マリカ、シラス、ヨコシオのライダー、マリカ。マピネです、マリカ。And that is also this, by the way. アディショナルスキルアイスタートがヘッドウェンドウェンドウェンドウェンドウェンドウェンドウェンドウェンドウェンドウェンドウェンドウェンドウェンドウェンドウェンドウェンドウェンドウェンドウェンドウェンドウェンドウェンドウェンドウェンドウェンドウェンドウェンドウェンドウェンドウェンドウェンドウェンドウェンドウェンドウェンドウェンドウェンドウェンドウェンドウェンドウェンドウェンドウェンドウェンドウェンドウェンドウェンドウェンドウェンドウェンドウェンドウェンドウェンドウェンドウェンドウェンドウェンドウェンドウェンドウェンドウェンドウェンドウェンドウェンドウェンドウェンドウェンまあ、ああ、ああ、ああ、ああ、ああ、ああ、ああ、ああ、ああ、ああ、ああ、ああ、ああ、ああ、ああ、ああ、ああ、ああ、ああ、ああ、ああ、ああ、ああ、ああ、ああ、ああ、ああ、ああ、ああ、ああ、ああ、ああ、ああ、ああ、ああ、ああ、ああ、ああ、ああ、ああ、ああ、ああ、ああ、ああ、ああ、ああ、ああ、ああ、ああ、ああ、ああ、ああ、ああ、ああ、ああ、ああ、ああ、ああ、Uh, let's go with. Hmm. Now, we haven't done with the decent one with this, right? So, yeah, let's try that. She's just a super robot at this point because she is! She's practically a super robot. And honestly. You can just mix between these two, by the way, if you, if you want. I mean, this is much slower, yes. But this guy has a charm. <laughs> uh, okay, what is the, the level up box? We need that, though. Oh, the one that opened up is the melee. We don't have much melee power here. We need gun. Oh well. Die. He died as well. Yeah, I have to use that just for the small fry. It's, it's ridiculous to be honest, but yeah, you know what? We make it work. Always. All right, we get the grand launcher. That one is good. I died! What the hell? What the hell hit me? That, was, that hit really hard. Was that an EX? I'm not sure that was an EX. That hurt so much. That hurt so much, come on. Yeah, but once I can hit them, oh boy, they're having fun. When it's my turn, they, they won't have much. They won't have fun. But if it's their turn, I'm going to die very really easily. See? 
They don't have it. Once I get the fight third, they will die. But have to be careful. I don't have a puzzle HP left. Okay, let's just stick up for some part for now. I don't want to lose this. I need the money. Okay, I got off this. For the good sake, you need to research Diego on Facebook. Oh, uh, seriously, just explain it to me, please. Like, I already have too much stuff on Twitter Facebook, you know. Oh, you just shoot me! A living legend. Okay. Oh yeah, make a good guy. Just in time. It always works. The Queen B is a It's not Queen B. Queen B is a H producer. It's Queen Jacket. It's based on the yellow jacket. Come on. <laughs> it's not Queen B. Queen B is a um, an animation studio, you know? Or that kind of stuff. You know? That thing that gives you pleasure. Oh, yeah, come back here. Oh, yes, I have an I think. Oh, holy shit! Yeah, if I can. Still. He hits hard, what the hell? Oh yeah, that's so good. I cannot jump. I'm out of boost. There you go. Hello. What the fuck are you want to to get where he's at? Yeah. Go back here. Yeah, it's pretty cool. <laughs> I don't think we can kill the Bromayos though. 
Oh, I want that spike somehow. Oh, thank God there's a healer. Now, the question is how am I supposed to destroy this thing? Well, I just woke on one rage, but not well. Oh, I got the kill. Holy shit. This thing works so well. <laughs> I guess the finisher. He's going to die. That took so much time to be done with. The other way around. What a story. A living legend in the other way around. Ah, okay. Oh, I'll never mean that Queen B, but you're right, I'll call her Queen Jacket. <laughs> ah, yeah, see what I mean? Oh, I never got this. That's something. I reckon. I'll take that. Uh. <laughs> Alright, one last match, and then. Photo session, I guess. Oh wow, it's been a while since last time I reached four hours in terms of stream time. All right, Kendo Diego, your third. Oh boy, <laughs> this melee fighter. It's gonna be fun. So I'm going to fight a bunch of. Unit with long range, so it's gonna be a little tough, but we're going to make it work. After this, we're going to try to post it for photo, and I'm going to take a few screenshots so we can display it on my Twitter and Facebook page. <laughs> As always. He's slow as well, but uh, it's not too bad. Alright, we got the heal. Self defense is very important to survival at this If you play this game long enough, it's really good. Alright, that's not a kill. I forgot this is trust of speed. Oh, yeah, go back here. I can't believe he just jumped it over. Almost though. Jump! Boom! <laughs> go back here. Let's pick up all the part here. Alright, Tatsuka no Tsurugi is also ready, so we can step multiple items. This is pretty good. I mean, this is basically just Barbatos with hips. 
get all out of our mark, but oh, now we need one more. This is antenna, but we can see the map much more clear. Subnacle is the last one that needs to be unlocked, unfortunately. That one usually is pretty good to grab an enemy and start a combo, basically. Alright, that's what I'm going to do again. This thing's really quick in terms of melee, thanks to the Gabriel Strike. Back here. Yeah, this thing's really fast in terms of melee. Alright, time to recover some parts here. No, 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 let me get out first, please. He's already stunned, by the way. I don't know why, but Ken Diego looks like he just made it a Japanese museum. That's practically what it is. That's the joke here. <laughs> Oh, he got stunned. He's going to die. Yeah, he's dead. <laughs> really dead. Uh, Oh, hello. Ow. Oh, you got it. That's not a pop, man. We have to kill Rekoto, but, well, we can play around a little bit. Holy shit, stop with that! That's... That's really something. Uh, where is Rekoto, by the way? Let's go member again. There she is. Oh, come on. Come here. There we go. Oh, oh my god, he, she's just running away. Yeah, she's dead. Yeah. There we go. Okay, bunch of stuff here. All right, let's go to the photo session this time. The Ronan. <laughs> yeah, I know, right? Not Ronin. Ronan. <laughs> All right, let's take a photo for both. Diego and the other guy. Um, pose.
let's make a pose first before we pick the background. Also, we need the melee weapon, so... There we go. Fresh out of the museum. <laughs> uh, yeah, I mean, it's practically like everything that he pick up is actually from the museum instead of his own. Or probably from eBay. Yeah, from eBay is also possible, you know. Maybe this is just some cheapskate parts. <laughs> Who knows, right? And then he just being weep. That's a possibility as well, you know. the gun pose um right Finding the post is kind of hard. A good eBay mobile should imagine that. I know, right? <laughs> Man, this middle part is really long it actually hit the ground <laughs> i'm pretty sure if it's the actual kit it will be mounted a, a bit higher than this i'll get cut i'm pretty sure it's probably gonna get cut for functional for functional purpose but yeah he's a complete whip let's use this uh Nah, uh, it, it doesn't work actually. Like, we need something that's somewhat out of place for him. Yeah, this works. I think this will work. Uh, how do I... There we go, that actually works. Okay, background. What to do here? Not the school area. School area sucks. Ah, uh, yeah, it's probably a desert or snow like this again. Snow area is actually kind of nice. Actually, desert works better, so let's go with that. Or Diego here. Like, every single weapon he bring on the back, like, holy shit. Alright, that's one. The other one, like, here. Let's edit this guy. Let's remove the shield, though. The shield is kind of bothering, but we need that on gameplay purpose. Oh, that's why it's there. Oh, this works. <laughs> that is the same pose, so 
Yeah. I can't even see the face with this pose. <laughs> oh, let's go with this pose. So it looks like it's fighting Diego. Yeah, let's go with this pose. Flex? Hang on, I, I mean like this. Like this is like it's fighting the other guy, you know? Let's try to find a flex pose though because we need that as well. <laughs> sure on the flex because I don't think there is any flex pose right now well assuming it's gonna be updated which it's not <laughs> uh, we need flex pose for the flex oh you come to me Diego Ah, this right here. This thing is really tall. <laughs> Oh, this thing looks, looks really angry. Would it? We'll find a nice place here for the pose. Uh, it's not really visible because how grim the background here. That uppercut pose looks good too if nothing else works. This works though. Let's go with this one. I mean... Oh! <laughs> oh, look at that. Look how menacing that is. If you if this doesn't tell you it's a menacing mobile suit, I've got blood. This is really menacing. God, the mech knife like just loses intimidation from the front view. Yeah, that's true though. That's why it's better to pick it at the side. But the silhouette is really strong. The way the silhouette is, it's really strong. I really like it though. I got this. Yeah, but I want to see close this with the Kendo Diego because. Obviously, this is one of the interesting build that I've been making. Well, the other one is also interesting, so let's let's just end it with the insecticide for today. So yeah, I guess that is it for today. You are monster energy can. Uh, so yeah, that is it for today. I hope you guys enjoyed the stream. If you like it, feel free to press that like button. If you want to see my content, then hit that subscribe button. And don't forget to turn on that bell notification so you can be notified for my future content. 
and uh, also feel free to follow my twitter and like my facebook page if you want to keep up to date with me and yeah i guess that's that it's really fun building two different mech one is suddenly become making a gundam style color unit which is actually harder than i was expecting and the other is just letting you guys build an entire new robot and looks like pretty cool and it's really memeable with, with the way it's placed to be honest i'm not going to lie <laughs> it, it just cheap damage when it's melee until it starts shooting the cannon <laughs> it's funny it's really funny i really like it but well that's the end for today's stream uh thanks for watching and remember i'm gonna be wise on you so keep on living buddy keep on living i'll see you guys on the next one goodbye Oh my god, that insect is cider though. <laughs> the, the, the number is pretty small, but it has so much burst, it's just ridiculous. It breaks every single part. It's. So, uh, yeah. It was really fun though.